WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a mostly cloudy Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. And we got all the U.S. indices. We had a sea of green out there is what we've got. All the U.S. indices trading the upside. One and a half percent for the Dow, 532 points, 2 percent for the S&P, 87 points, a little over 2 percent for the NDX 100. That's 320 points, nearly 5 percent for the Russell, 78 point move there. Three and a half percent for the semis, 125 points there. To the upside, you've also got uh, the XAU. Gold's up 17, 18 bucks. Silver's up 83 cents, 3 and 7 Tense lights we crude up a buck seventeen. The only thing I've got negative out here other than spot volatility is natural gas off two pennies. So do your treasure up two points and four ticks. Trade out at one fifteen thirteen. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart will begin upper left-hand corner of the ES Mini. What do we know? Well, the ES Mini doesn't have a top, didn't have a top yesterday, and right now is trading above the 0.618 retracement of its move down. It's above daily profiles, weekly profiles out there. Its next price target would be in the 45.64 zone. Spot volatility still well below its 50-day exponential moving average. That is always bullish for the S&P 5. I don't want to say always, but it does give buyers the edge. If you take a look at the NQ, it is negating its TD nine count top that completed yesterday that tells us about a strong momentum move a close today about 15809 suggests a run for its swing high out here that's a swing high from july of 2023 it's above the 0.6786 retracement area so that suggests that this wants to do a hundred percent move of a move but it doesn't matter what it looks like at 1101 it's really what does it look like at today's close at 5 p.m it prices above 1580971 odds favor it wants to make that hundred percent move of a move u.s dollar index if it closes the day below 104.69 it triggers an a to b equals cd to the downside that b to c retracement is only 55 percent odds would favor more than a one-to-one -one a to b equals cd but the initial price projection level is 103.66 gold forming a td9 count bottom completing that pattern yesterday new profile has formed today or is forming it's got resistance up at the 1989 level silver doesn't have a bottom, but it did form a bullish hammer candle yesterday, and it is targeting the top of its daily profile. That's at 23.30. If price can close above that, a run to the 23.92 level would be logical. Light to recruit has got a TD9 count bottom. And right now, price is making its way up to where a counter trend rally would fail. And that's the center of that bullish structured profile. So if this is something other than a counter trend move, we'd see a close above 80.12. Natural gas just consolidated with inside its profile that formed yesterday. That supported three. 304, resistance 328, and a 30 year treasury trying to maybe set up an A to B equal CD to the upside. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z show. But if you have to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.